and it's a great day for football in this lovely stadium. I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith, as usual, alongside me to provide the analysis. Ere de Vizzi action for you from the Netherlands. It's Emen against Pek Zwolle. Well, there's certainly a buzz in this stadium in the uh, minutes leading up to kick-off. I hope the match doesn't disappoint, I don't think it will. We've got a couple of attacking sides here. And this is today's starting lineup for the home team. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4 5 1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated, otherwise, this formation will not work. Let's have a look at how the opposing team will line up today. Well, it looks like all hands to the defensive pump. At least they've got two forwards. Yes, and uh, hopefully they will get some service, but uh, it is capable, this shape, of being pretty negative. Signal from the referee, and off we go. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Kenya. Space to cross the ball now. I think the opposition looked as though they believed they'd get through them, but they haven't, and now they can get on the ball and play. Clement. Clement. That would have been a chance, but for the tackle. Pena. Now, can they make this count? Keeping the ball well in a dangerous area now. He's had a go here. There it is. First goal of the game. And coming this early, the promise of more to come. This really is a team game, and that shows the value of team play. Several players involved, great passing, great movement on and off the ball. And a super goal. Yeah, it was the, the way he shifted the ball on. It was it was great team play, Martin. You're right. So the first goal, it's one nil. Clement. Still searching for an equaliser. There's some good interplay here. Chance for the cross. Very good challenge. Got the ball and they're going at the opposition with speed. Kenya. Lovely, incisive pass, onside and away. Trying to pick out a teammate at the near post. Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration, and they've won this match, I think. <laughs> they 
goal that's been put away in prime fashion. The defenders seem to lose the concentration almost. They saw it coming from a long way out. A good look here again by the replay of the goal. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Clement. to Nakayama. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. And it's behind for the goal kick. Oh, wonderful finish that is. I love to see headers of that nature from that distance. You don't see many. The visitors having lots of the ball, but you can see the manager down there is less than happy. Obviously, his team's losing, that's bad enough, but no real sign so far that they're going to get back into this because they're just not able to find a way through that defence and make the keeper work. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. Miguel Araujo. Araujo. Kenya over to Fry. Is he in here? Chance to cross it. Put the ball into the middle. Dangerous. And they get it away. We've got two added minutes. That's been signaled now. On the attack here, players arriving in the middle. Well, they've got to keep the crosses coming in. Well, that's half time, and 2 0 with the score at the halfway mark. Well, you can score a goal at any point in a game. He hasn't really looked like scoring any so far, has he? He'll be hoping for better as the match develops. It started slowly, and he hasn't been able to pick it up. Rarely has he got on the end of anything. So the referee's happy, the players are in position, the second half gets underway. Now he's switched the point of attack here. Lamb. Them off. They've lost the ball. Over to Fry. Impressive in possession. Passing's good, possibly dangerous. A couple of teammates up in support, and the defender able to clear it away. Oh, it could be on. It's another one for them. They go further in front, and they are full value for this position. Well, they've increased their lead here, and that could just wrap up the match. Yeah, they're the much better team out here today, and that scoreline reflects that.
the goal wherever you look at it it was very well taken So off they go again, trying to make some sort of mark in a game that they're being dominated in. Home team ready to make a change. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Could get his cross in now. Dealt with the danger. Well, this is clearly going to be the tactic until the final whistle, as long as it works, of course, defending. Well, they might not have much of an outlet. They've got nobody left up front. They're just defending in numbers, en masse. Aim for those in the middle. He's got it away. Clement. And they've spread it out wide here. Lamb. Clement. Opportunity to play it into the middle. Defender's done well here to clear the danger. Lamb. Excellent attacking play here. They could open up the opposition now. That's cut out. And it's gone out for a throw. Well, Alan, it is the substitution now. Well, he's done his bit. He got the goal that put his team in the lead. Can they hold that lead? Lamb. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Taking on a couple of opponents now. Up for grabs here. And the referee blows his whistle. The flag was up for offside. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Well, he's done his bit. He got the goal that put his team in the lead. Can they hold that lead? Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Whipped in from the wide area. That's a very weak cross from a very good position. We're down now to the last six minutes. He could take them on here. That's not what he wanted to do, a poor pass. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. He's got the option to get in across now. Well, that should be the game. You could call it another insurance goal. Surely they can't throw it away here. Great understanding there between the crosser and the lad in the middle. Lost his marker brilliantly. And we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. There's no doubt that the scoreline reflects realistically the nature of the game. There's nothing false about it. They've thoroughly... And the referee has now called a halt. I guess the opposition will feel that they could have maybe shown a bit more punch, but 
I'm afraid one team was much better than the other. Yeah, they just weren't good enough on the day to lose inside. We expected a bit more, I have to say.